So welcome back to yet another video. It is Codebreaker Gaming back with another Tekken 8 character customization video. And in today's video, in honor of the newly released X-Men 97, now streaming on Disney Plus, if you guys haven't seen it, you absolutely need to check it out. It is outstanding. But nonetheless, in honor of the X-Men 97, that is the inspiration of this Tekken 8 customization series we are going to be recreating individual x-men characters here in tekken 8 and in today's character customization video we are going to be creating the field team leader of charles xavier's x-men ladies and gentlemen the boy scout known as scott summers you know him better as Cyclops, the field team leader of the X-Men. So without any further delay, let's jump into what needs to take place to create Cyclops in Tekken 8. For starters, you wanna make sure you have Kazuya Mishima selected as the character that we're gonna be making this customization of Cyclops into. I'll get into why Kazuya is important towards the end of the video so for starters we're on his body the first thing we are going to change is his hair now for the hairstyle that we're going to use i highly highly encourage you guys to use the hairstyle entitled heroic shortcut now let's take a look at how that looks as you guys can see it has like a little look like highlighted uh top portion of it I think it looks amazing with this customization so in order to get this particular customization part as you guys can see the little icon up there at the top that has the five stars it is a part of the Tekken 8 season pass so uh, you gotta you know play a bunch of different various modes online everything you do online gains you experience that experience levels up your season pass and as the season pass levels you unlock new customization parts um, banners and things like that so this is one of the parts that you unlock in that season pass and you'll know it by the five star icon you have at the top near the name heroic shortcut as you can see there this is the hairstyle we're going to be using for Scott Summers we're gonna back out of the hairstyle we're gonna move down to the eyes uh, the eyes it doesn't matter which eyes you use for this particular look um, <clears throat> but to keep things interesting I would suggest picking the white glow eyes <clears throat> as you can see there and what you want to do is after you selected them you want to hit the triangle option never mind there, <clears throat> there is no triangle option <laughs> but I was gonna change them red um, you can also use the devil eyes again whichever eyes you decide to use they're not really important okay so we'll keep it on the devil eyes just as a formality we're back out of that you guys know Scott Summers wears no facial hair so we're not gonna be touching that eyebrow color does not matter facial makeup will not matter face paint I like using this edgy face paint again this comes from the season pass it's one of the custom parts that you will unlock as you level up your season pass and I know you guys are thinking like what the hell is that that looks like something that can go on quite possibly another X-Man that is coming to this customization series <laughs> we'll talk about that a little later we're not going to tan his skin complexion or anything like that and we're actually done with the first step now we're going to hit circle again to come back to the main character customization menu we're going to move down to close we're not going to put anything on his head we're not going to put anything on his full face we come down to glasses and we will be using something here but before we do that let's go to his entire body under his entire body we're going to be using the cyber suit and again this is something that comes from the Tekken shop it is uh, purchasable, purchasable using Tekken coins I believe this pack they have two different packs one for the male characters one for the female characters so you want to gonna 
you're going to want to purchase the cyber suit pack for the male characters to unlock this skin and when you do every male character in the game will have it you want to select that cyber suit okay now once you've selected the cyber suit we're going to go ahead and hit triangle and we're going to begin making changes here so to start off immediately with color palette number one oh gosh with color palette number one there we are I'm going to take a look at this nice yellow here that's not the one we're going to use <laughs> we're going to actually use we're going to use this top this royal blue here so color palette number one will be that nice royal blue okay for color palette number two We're going to go ahead and also make that this sweet, sweet royal blue. For color palette number three, we're not going to... Actually, for color palette number three, we're going to make that this gold color. Color palette number three is his boots and his gloves. And as you guys can see, this is already shaping up very nicely. For color palette number four, that is also going to be the same gold color here. You guys seeing what I'm working with here? And for color palette number five, we're going to also make that gold. And you see that? Quite easy. We have gone through, it's only five color palettes for the cyber suit. Now, let's, let's revisit color palette number two. Yep. Color palette number two will stay this royal blue color. And that is all we're going to do for the cyber suit customization. We're going to hit circle. We're going to back out of that and go back to the parts menu. We're not going to be using any shoes, anything that's unique, no lower body or upper body. But we are going to come back to the glasses. And this is where we're really going to make sure that everyone knows that we're using Cyclops. So we're going to click on glasses. And we're going to come down here. We're going to use this part here. It's called the blindfold. Okay. And this is why I said it doesn't really matter which eyes that you use because the blindfold will cover his eyes like so. As you can see, doesn't matter which eyes you use at this point, they will not be visible. Okay. Now, once you have the blindfold selected, you're going to go ahead and hit triangle. And you're going to change it to this gold color. Like so. Then we're going to hit circle, we're going to back out, we're going to come back to the top character customization menu, and we're going to click on accessory, okay? This is the very important part here. So once you click on accessory, we'll go to accessory number one, slot number one, and you're going to want to come down and you're going to want to pick the Alice Band, okay? Now we're going to zoom into Cyclops so you guys can see what's about to take place. As you guys can see, it put this at the top of his head. Now, what we're going to do here, we're going to rotate it down. You see what's happening? Okay. Rotate it down there. Then we're going to go. So, rotate down should be set to 56. We're going to come to move up and move down, and we're going to move it down at a minus four, okay? Then you want to go to move front and back, and you want to have that at a minus, minus three, okay? Because if you do minus four, then that happens right there. Now, uh, perhaps that may not bother you guys. I don't particularly like how that how that looks on the uh, left side of his face uh, so we keep that at minus three okay you guys see what's happening there now what you want to do here is you want to confirm that and once you've confirmed it you hit triangle and we're going to change this to that nice ruby red that would be this one here this one you could also use actually let's use the let's use the brighter of the two so let's use uh this red 
and it's only one color palette as you can see and that creates that a uh, nice ruby red octic color oct octic blast color that uh, Cyclops's eyes produce when he's not wearing the visor we're not going to use a second accessory at all okay as you guys can see that is a, a very fitting customization of Scott Summers aka Cyclops field team leader of the X-Men so we're gonna back out of that circle now for other you guys can use whatever character panel you like to use for uh, Scott Summers I personally like this one but now for his aura this is important you guys may like this you may not I love it so I go to the bottom and I like to use is it the red aura I feel like I believe that is the correct one it's not bigger It's not the fiery arm aura either. Yep. Now, some of you guys may like to play with the auras. Some of you may not. I like to use this red aura because I like to, in my mind, imagine that this is him powering up the optic blast. As you can see, I picked the red aura because his optic blast is supposed to be red as well as you can see from the visor. Now, we're going to back out of that. For the hit effect, you guys can do what you want here. Um, you don't have to use anything. I think I chose to use something uh, circle, purple, maybe. But you guys don't have to. You can you can use whatever you like here. This is just for a little bit of added effect. Actually, I'm going to use the Phoenix Feathers for my hit effect. I'm going to circle. We're going to come out of there. Now for the thumbnail, I'm going to change the background to background number two, and that makes it really pop. So now that red aura looks so much better, so much better. Now we're going to back out of that. You guys can change the pose if you like. They only have two for the time being. Pose number two is fight ready. I don't particularly, uh, I don't particularly like it. So I'm going to change back to pose number one. And the pose is simply for the uh, the thumbnail that we're going to shoot. Now we'll shoot his thumbnail. Now at this point, you can hold R2 to zoom in. You can push in the touchpad and use the left stick to move the frame. We'll zoom in a little bit more. A little bit more. And we push X once you've framed it the way you want it. You push X it'll take the picture use this image as the customization slot thumbnail we're gonna push yes and we're gonna back out of here and ladies and gentlemen at this point we can push finish editing and we have effectively and very accurately created it. Scott Summers aka Cyclops the field team leader of the X-Men and once again ladies and gentlemen if you have not already done so you need to be watching X-Men 97 which is now streaming on Disney Plus the animated show is absolute fire I cannot stress that enough it is absolute fire and once again X-Men 97 is the inspiration for this Tekken 8 character customization video and as a result it's the inspiration for this Tekken 8 customization series where we will be recreating uh, all of uh, the X-Men to the best of our ability with the customization parts currently available here in Tekken 8. Ladies and gentlemen, if you have enjoyed this video, I need you to do me a favor. Tap that like button. Drop a comment in the comment section and let me know how dope 
this character customization video of Cyclops from X-Men actually is. Do you think I did a good job? Do you think he should be uh, maybe look a little bit different? Or tell me what you would change about him. I absolutely think this is a flawless character customization. You guys also want to make sure that you are subscribed to the channel with your notifications turned on. If you enjoy my Tekken 8 character customization videos, you want to have those notifications on so you'll be notified immediately when I drop the next character in this series or any series moving forward here in Tekken 8 customization you do not want to miss them they are going to be dropping soon and they are all going to be fire as well this has been code breaker gaming before we go we're going to play a match with this cyclops so you guys can see why using kazuya mishima was incredibly important for this customization let's check it out all right ladies and gentlemen here's the match so you can see why Kazuya was so important Round for this one. customization. Some of you Fight. may already know. Optic Blast. Optic Blast. Round two. Fight. Cyclops and Tekken 8, ladies and gentlemen. This guy wants a rematch. I'll give it to him. Round one. Fight. <laughs> Fight! 
I think he's slowly realizing that he can't win. Duck him. Optic Blast. Optic Blast. Optic Blast. Doria. Yeah, I think he's done now. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it. Scott Summers, a.k.a. Cyclops, from X-Men 97, here in Tekken 8. If you like this video, once again, hit that like button. Drop a comment below. Let me know how, we how well this customization looks indeed like Cyclops. This is Big Cold Breaker Gaming. I want to thank you guys for joining me. Make sure you're subscribed to the channel with your notifications turned on so you can be notified when I upload the next Tekken 8 X-Men 97 character customization. See you in the next one. Peace.